Hi, Cliff with Primary Mover. We're back looking at the hydraulic jacks on trailers. We want to give you a quick test on how you can check to see if you have an integrated counterbalance valve on your jack. So what we're going to do is we're going to raise this jack or lower this jack to raise the trailer, put some pressure on it, and we're going to loosen these hydraulic fittings and see what happens on the jack. All right, so now we're going to raise the trailer by lowering the jack. Now we have some pressure. Now the jack has pressure on it, the jack leg has pressure on it. Let's loosen these fittings and see what happens. All right, and we've begun to loosen these hose fittings on this jack, and as you can see, just a little bit more. It's, it's already starting to, to drain out of these. And if we open it up even more, you will see this, the trailer begin to lower and the jack will start to come up. You wanna do a little more? It's really coming out now. Is it beginning to go down? It's resting on the ball now. Okay, as you saw, when it began to seep out, that was similar to a hose failure or what it could be as it, it um, begins to seep past the spool valve on the pump itself. So we proved by that seepage that this in the trailer going down, this had no integrated counterbalance valve in it, which we'll be switching it out soon for a primary mover that has it in it. But we're gonna go over to another trailer here, take a look at it, a trailer that has the primary mover on it with the integrated counterbalance valve and show you how it should work. All right, we're back here again. We're at our dump trailer. This is our primary mover dump trailer that we use to test all our equipment. And we use and abuse this thing. Well, we've loaded it with the tractor and we have jacked the trailer down, lifting the uh, trailer up off of the, the, whole, the ball, as you can see that gap. And what we're gonna do now is we're gonna test to see if this truly has an integrated a counterbalance valve in it by taking these hoses off of here. If it is, it should hold this jack in place and not allow it to move. So let's give it a try. As you can see, the hoses have been removed. So this jack is rock solid, it has not moved. That's a safety feature for the uh, integrated compensation valve. So this is what we put on all of our primary mover jacks and what you can expect from primary mover.